I think institutionally, the State University of New York is very unique. We are a big system with all the sectors under one umbrella. So in addition to paying attention to the membership organizations that serve community colleges and technical schools and baccalaureate institutions and doctoral institutions and medical schools, this is like one-stop shopping. I can put all the sector needs into one basket under one umbrella and look at SUNY more holistically and, and know that somebody working in academic affairs that needs to serve both a community college and a doctoral institution simultaneously can get help here. And there are other systems that have diverse sectors within them. So I think in addition to seeing ACE as a single institution membership organization, this is a wonderful place for systems to be connected. Well, I have two ways of thinking about our work nationally. I mean, we're all at home. We all have a day job. But getting out and networking and getting the big issues is really important to me. So under the category of thought leadership, I always want to know who's giving the marquee keynote addresses. I look at the topics, and I did this this past year, and I see people awarded and lifted up by ACE who are great leaders, and it, it, it says to me, this is a place where leadership is recognized and where I can come and sort of drink from the fountain of issues that, frankly, at home I, I don't have enough time to, to deal with. And the second thing I really feel strongly about is uh, this concept called collective impact, that really we can't solve our nation's challenges one institution at a time. We have to come together and be more impactful collectively. And this is the place to see that collective impact. But when I think about the way ACE respects and cultivates leadership, I, I really want to make it accessible to all the stakeholders at the State University of New York. So serving people who are presidents, people who want to be presidents, people who are provosts, people who want to be provosts, serving gender and ethnicity and growing the ranks of people who traditionally have not served in leadership positions, that's a real personal passion of mine. And so every time I connect, with someone who's in leadership development to help themselves so that they can help their organizations. It kind of renews my faith in leadership and, and that's what ACE does for me personally and for so many people around the country.